Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to the latest episode on the Scan Tool Network. As the video title suggests and as we can see on the table here, we've got four multi-vehicle and multi-system diagnostic packages that we feel are the best diagnostic packages for any DIY user, any home user, small garage, small workshop, or anybody who generally has a fleet of vehicles um, or more than one vehicle that they need to look after and uh, maybe service or do their own work on. Um, ultimately though, um, these are all very good tools. I'm going to put the links to these tools in the description below this video and we're going to talk about why I think these tools are the best at what they do and at the end of the video what I'll do is I'll give my personal recommendation as to which one of these tools I would personally buy if it was my money based on specific circumstances okay um, so we've as I say we've got four to it there are many tools on the market that cover this particular sector so uh, multi-vehicle manufacturers there are lots of tools on there but I feel that these are the best four tools um, to show you because the there are lots of tools that may not do the job as well as they say they will um, they, a lot of them will give communication faults and the software just isn't really that good now I'm not saying that these tools won't give communication faults because from time to time they can um, and the software just needs a little bit more development to uh, to get you through but ultimately I would say probably 95% of the time these tools are going to come good for you and they will do exactly what they say on the tin. Uh, so we'll start with the cheapest and we'll work our way through to the most expensive. Now when I say the most expensive this 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 kit here is the most expensive on the table but it's still within reach of any DIY any small garage workshop or any fleet manager who has a lot of vehicles to look after so this one here has been on the market for a few years now it's the iCarsoft CR Pro kit um, and I'll give certain facts about each tool as we go along and it, it'll give a good idea as to uh, how we can compare them so this is 259 pounds again link in the description below this video and I've got a prompt sheet here um, so that's about 345 dollars uh, when it comes to systems that it will cover within the vehicle it's going to cover all of the systems so it'll cover like engines airbags ABS transmission and then it'll do your other systems as well like your power steering systems the HVAC air suspension etc so any any it's going to be different from car to car but any system that is installed to a vehicle this tool will allow you to actually go ahead and diagnose and reset that uh, when it comes to special functions this has eight special functions so the special functions special functions are the same as service functions so they can include things like uh, dpf regeneration service reset electronic throttle control or calibration steering angle sensor calibration injector coding abs brake bleeding battery uh, new battery registration um, there might be something else I've missed out there as well. There probably is, but I think it's like eight or nine um, service or special functions that this tool will give you. Um, it doesn't do bi-directional tests. So if you want a test like a wiper or a window or a door lock or something like that, it doesn't allow you to do that. Um, and it doesn't do mileage corrections either. When it comes to updates, it gives free updates for life. Okay, so that is the iCars of CR Pro. As I say, £259 or $345. This has been um, an absolutely fantastic seller for probably about two or three years now. And um, it, it's still selling really, really well because it, it, if you don't necessarily need high-end functions like bi-directional tests or anything like that, um, all you really want to do is just maybe reset some systems or you know knock off a warning light in a, a wide range of vehicles then you don't need to look any further than this tool so that's still a good tool it doesn't have a built-in battery as you can see all of the other screens are turned on this tool gets its power by plugging it into the vehicle these have internal batteries okay and we'll come to that as, as well so that's the CR Pro. Next up is the iCarsoft CR Max kit. CR Max kit is kind of like a, an upgraded version of this with more functions. It does cost more as well. Um, so if we're looking at the CR Max, this is currently priced at £359 or $479. Again, link in the description. Um, it does everything that this tool does. So it does all of your main systems, engines, airbags, ABS, transmission, and all of the systems which are included in the vehicle, as I mentioned earlier. Um, but when it comes to special functions and service functions, this does 23. So it does all of the special functions that this tool does, but this also does like calibrations. It'll do uh, like uh, suspension calibrations. It'll do actuations. It'll code certain components to a vehicle. Um, 
Again, though, it all really depends on the specific vehicle. Uh, so, but this one is an upgraded version of this one. Now, when it comes to bi-directional tests and um, actuation tests or component testing, this tool does do it. So if you wanted to, if you had a problem with say like a passenger door locking or passenger window not going up or down, and you wanted to try and pinpoint as to where the problem was, you could test the motor on it. So this would basically do a test um, of the motor to make sure it was working. So if it was working with the motor, but it wasn't with the switch, then you, you can work out that you've got a faulty switch. So it allows you to um, sort of rule in or rule out certain components if you've got a fault in a particular area which is a really really good feature of this tool um, and this is what that's what well that's one of the things that sets it over and above this tool here the special functions and the component or bi-directional or actuation tests uh, so this does all major manufacturers sorry I, I mentioned this this does all main, major manufacturers as well this also does the same this does all major manufacturers apart from the supercars with the likes of uh, um, Ferrari, um, Aston Martin, Lamborghini. It does. It does newer Lamborghinis from about 2014 onwards. Um, but if you've got an older, say like an older Gallardo or something, it wouldn't do that if you're lucky enough. Uh, but all major European, Asian, and American manufacturers, it'll cover. Um, when it comes to Mileage correction, again, I mentioned that and it'll become apparent when we come to these two tools. It doesn't do any mileage correction at all. So don't purchase this tool if you're looking for that. Um, when it comes to updates, again, free for life. These two tools, free updates for life. So once you've paid for the tool, you'll never have to pay for anything else again. So that's the iCarsoft CL Max. Uh, we then come on now to, this screen's gone off, I wonder if it's a battery. Uh, the batteries are quite low on these, or just a, um, yeah, it's like a screensaver kind of thing. Oh, it's telling me to plug it in. Uh, that one looks like it's, has this one gone off as well? It has. Right. So they have screensavers built into them and you can change the amount of time they stay on for. Um, okay, so this is the Autel MK808 kit. This has been a really, really popular tool as well over the past few years. Um, really rugged sort of tablet design where you could, same with all three of these, you can kind of uh, be using them as a diagnostic tool through the day or you can um, use them as a tablet or your kids can be playing games on them of a nighttime surf of the internet or whatever you need to do. Uh, price wise for this one, £469, which works out at $625. It is a bit more expensive. Hotel, I think for many years have been seen as um, the, the, the top of the table company to go to for diagnostics. Um, I would say that certainly was the case up until about two or three years ago. Um, in which case, I think from that point onwards, you're certainly looking at iCarsoft to be the, uh, the top manufacturer for diagnostic tools. Uh, but that's, that's just purely my opinion based on what we've seen. We see lots of tools coming in on a day-to-day -day basis. We get the ability to test all of these tools on different vehicles. And uh, for the money you pay for this tool, uh, this tool is, is right up there with it, okay? But we'll come to that in a moment. So this is the, yeah, um, 469 or $625. Uh, systems, again, all systems, does everything that these do when it comes to uh, systems-wise, all systems in the vehicle. Um, special functions, this will do, did I mention this does 23? I think I did. This does 26 special functions, all right? So your service functions, again, look in the listing, it'll display all of the service functions. Um, and when it comes to bi-directional, and actuation or component testing, this is where this one falls short because it doesn't do any of that. So you're paying a lot more for the tool than this tool, but you're getting less of a feature, if that makes sense. Um, it covers all major manufacturers, the same as these. This also covers uh, like Chinese models as well. If anyone's got a Chinese vehicle, I very much doubt that though. But it does do, um, I'm fairly sure it does do like Ferrari as well. Um, Let me just check. I'm sure. I'm sure it does do Ferrari. I could be wrong. The listing. The listing will confirm that. Um, but all major manufacturers will be covered there as well. Um, when it comes to what we're we looking at next, mileage correction. It does do a little bit of mileage correction, but 
it's very, very few vehicles that the software is for. Um, so it, I wouldn't really buy this tool or any of these tools really if you are dead certain on just doing mileage correction. Um, we'll come to this one, why this one's a bit different in a moment, but um, it's very, very few vehicles and the chances are, let's say you had a BMW 3 Series and you wanted to do the mileage, it probably wouldn't do it. It'll do some obscure vehicle like a Peugeot, a Peugeot Bipper or something from 2015. Uh, it doesn't do mileage correction on BMWs in any case. So um, I would say just steer clear of it for mileage correction because it's not worth going down that route. Um, it's not a specialized tool for that particular function. Uh, when it comes to updates, you know, mentioned these two get free updates for life. This, up, this tool gives you free updates for one year. And after that, you have to pay about 130 pounds per year to get it updated. So that's a bit of a downside to this tool. A bit of a downside is uh, also that doesn't do the bi-directional, but if you're not bothered about that, then it's a, it's a good tool to go for. But also costs a bit more as well. So it's, it's all about really finding the, the right balance and what tool would be best for you based on the information I'm giving. Uh, so that's the Autel MK808 kit. Um, we come to the last tool now. This is the Xtool D7. And this tool costs £479 or $640. Um, systems, again, it covers all systems within the vehicle like these tools do as well. Uh, when it comes to special functions, it comes with 26 pre-installed special functions. Again, check the listing in the link below uh, to find out which ones are covered. Um, Bi-directional tests, component testing, actuation test, it does all of those, um, which is a good feature of this tool. We've tried and tested it and it does them without, without any issues at all. Um, it covers all major manufacturers uh, from all continents like Australia, Asia, Europe, America. I mean, that's probably it. Um, and it also covers Ferrari. This definitely does cover Ferrari and Aston Martin vehicles. So these don't do that. So that is, if, you, if, you're, really, if you're lucky enough to own a Ferrari or an Aston Martin, the, this vehicle, uh, sorry, this kit will do that for you. Um, mileage correction again, this is, this is a bit different to this one. This does do mileage correction, probably on about 50% of the vehicles that are out there. So again, though, I wouldn't necessarily buy it if you had, if you were, dead cert on getting it as a mileage correction tool, but just be aware it can do mileage correction uh, on certain manufacturers. It, it's very random as to which ones it will cover, but it will certainly do more than this tool for mileage correction. Um, when it comes to updates for this one, this is gonna give you three years free updates. And then after that, there is a yearly update cost of 77 pounds, I think it is, or like $100. Um, so. You know, at least you get three years free out of this one and the update cost, the yearly update cost is cheaper with this tool. Um, one thing to know about these two tools that do charge for yearly updates, you have no obligation to actually go through and get the updates done on your, on your tool. So let's say you've come to the end of your free update period and you, you get a prompt on screen to say, do you wish to up, upgrade the software? You'll have to pay. Uh, you can just click no to that and you can continue to use the tool exactly as it was as per the last update. So don't feel like you're under any obligation. If the tool works perfectly well for your needs as you need it, then why go and update it? It's already working exactly as you need it to. Okay, so th those are the four tools, as I say, that, that we would recommend for anybody who's looking at maybe picking up one of these tools for their, their own fleet or their own um, garage workshop. You don't need, really know what you're going to be getting in on a day-to-day -day basis, or maybe you just want to look after their own cars in your family or you're an, you're an enthusiast club, club or something like that. I mentioned at the start of the video that I would uh, personally recommend one of these tools that if it was my money, um, what would I personally put my money towards if um, I had more than one vehicle or multi-vehicles to look after? Um, hand on heart, honestly, it would be this tool here, the iCarsoft CR Max. Simply because the start price is cheaper, it doesn't have, it has free updates for life, it does all systems, it does pretty much all manufacturers, it does bi-directional, it does uh, actuation tests, it does coding, component testing, um, and lots of service functions that you'll find that the modern day cars uh, do need when something needs to be changed or something, or you get like a, a warning on the, on the dashboard. So 
I would honestly choose this tool, free updates for life, as I say, $359 or $479. Um, I'll put the link, I'll put the links to all of them, but um, I would seriously go for this one here if it was my money. Um, and that about wraps things up. Um, I hope you've maybe taken something from this video. What I'll do is, I'll, um, I'll try and fit, this, this is my little sort of prom sheet which has a comparison of all the tools. So I'll try and figure out a way to put this in the description, maybe upload it uh, online or something so you can have a look in your own time. And it basically just, it's just a basic spreadsheet which gives basic information on which of these tools will do what, what prices, how many functions, etc. So I'll try and figure out a way to put that in the description so you can look at it in your own time. All right, uh, if you have found this video useful, then really appreciate it if you can click that like button. And uh, yeah, links below and we'll see you on the next video.